Well, the late Roberto Clemente is the pride and joy of Puerto Rico. His fans called him the great one. Along the way, he broke records and barriers in Major League Baseball as a Pittsburgh Pirate. And now, as we celebrate Hispanic Heritage Month, he's being honored at the Paley Center for his many achievements on and off the baseball field. Eyewitness News reporter Darla Miles with his story. He's got the best right fielder basically in the game. That right fielder was number 21 who played for the Pittsburgh Pirates from 1955 through 1972, Roberto Clemente. If I go hit, I hit anyhow. I don't, I don't care about the mound or who is pitching. I had a locker next to him. Roberto took me under his wing and he treated me like a son. I was 21. He's a superstar and uh, he made me feel so wanted. On a team. The 15 time MLB All Star was the very first Latino ever to be inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame in 1973. And this exhibit is taking place on the 50th anniversary of his induction into the Baseball Hall of Fame. That exhibit at the Paley Center for Media features Clemente's actual baseball hat and bat and collectibles like baseball cards, stadium seats, and even an old cornflakes box with his picture on it. And the only way I can describe him, he's a better person than a ball player. Tragically, in 1972, Clemente was killed in an airplane crash en route to help the victims of a devastating earthquake in Nicaragua. Just a few months later after his death, Major League Baseball suspended their waiting period and unanimously invited him into the Hall of Fame. The MLB still honors him annually by naming a Roberto Clemente Award recipient and by hosting a day of service. The Puerto Rican who shattered racial barriers and paved the way for future Latino greats. He was an asset to the game because of the way he played, the way he treated people, and what he did for other people um, was just fantastic.